was doing well. Um, listen up. I, I, um, Maran and I stayed last night to finish the job. So uh, we're just in this morning before we leave. We just had breakfast. Man, we went to the Waffle House, the Jasper Waffle House for breakfast, man. Woo! I recommend it. If you ever come here, you have to go there for breakfast. It's so good. Anyway, so we worked, uh, we worked straight through last night to finish. And we figured we'd just go to the hotel, sleep in, uh, get a good breakfast, and then head back this morning. So, um, yeah, done. Mission accomplished. We drove up yesterday uh, morning, got here around noon hour, and we worked till it was literally eight o'clock at night. It was, uh, it was, it was great actually. Um, so uh, we got it all done in eight hours, uh, which is which is good. So to give you a rundown of what we what we did here, um, well, first of all, well, since I'm here, this is just an infill framed and drywalled on both sides. Okay, uh, we had to drywall this whole wall. Okay. Um, five eighths to add a second layer to fire rate it to separate it from the unit next to us. So uh, it, I think that's eleven feet right there. So uh, ten foot stand ups and then a little top and then like you see how I do it. Uh, we um, uh, I, I I measure my sheet to right beneath the cutouts. So when I do my tops, I'm just slipping it on. You know what I mean? Like it's just super easy. Uh, even like here, okay, I got I got the joint right there and I'm using board to board screws laminating screws here Okay, and um, I can get my two inch in the top track and in the stud, right? Uh, yeah, this is just some kind of middle wall for the separating the, the like I think the like the kitchen and the dish pit area um, We only had nine foot studs here, so we had to extend them and that's how we extend them. You see that? Right? Hey, what's up, Clyde Guy John? And, uh, oh, yeah, buddy, I'm, I'll, I'll take you guys outside. I'll take you outside and show you the mountain and the, in the area. Jas this is where, I'm in Jasper, buddy, in Canada and Alberta here. Uh, we had to frame this and drywall. Oh. And then, um, like I said, we had to drywall this as well going back to that unit, right? So the, that whole fire separation is done. Um, the plugs were all in. So we, you just take them off, you know, um, and measure side to side, up and down, make sure you're counting for a half inch off the floor and cut it out. <laughs> uh, and then when you're putting your sheet on, you just slip the thing through or whatever. So this is the front where the, this is like a little Caesars pizza joint. So the digital signs will be up here. They'll be backing in there eventually. But uh, another little thing here as well, when you're, you're double studying here, uh, I just learned this yesterday. I never seen this before, but he put a screw in, in through here into the flange uh, to keep the studs together. So look at it, like it's so sturdy, it's crazy. So that's a cool trick. To tell you guys you learn something new every day almost <laughs> but no good stuff nice it was nice and glad we did we, we decided to work through got some good sleep and uh, we're ready to go nice you know good condition to drive back and not tired at the end of the day or anything like that but yeah check this place out so this is right on the main strip of jasper right on Yeah, it's beautiful, guys. I'm so jealous. I want to go snowboarding so bad. But when we come back to uh, drywall and tape the rest, I'm going to uh, bring my board for sure. Yeah, it's been way too long. Uh, last time I been on the hill, it was so long ago. My, I think my son was a kid. Like, he was a, a little baby. And I uh, was uh, working in Banff. And... Uh, I, on some, uh, I think it was called Sp uh, Spring Creek. That was what it was called, like uh, condos or whatever. Anyways, so I was, I was, I had a rented apartment in Canmore. It was awesome. Yeah, they're definitely gonna relocate the track and everything. The uh, the electricians haven't even started this job yet, right? But yeah, you can see where did we go? 
We went to, yeah, there's the waffle place we went for breakfast down here. Oh my God. And then right next door is a place called Nova Pizza where we had pizza last night because we, it was around 10 o'clock. We're trying to find somewhere, something to have for dinner. And uh, it was, it was, it was, a, it was open. It was amazing pizza too. <sighs> but yeah, look how cool it is. It was a nice hotel, super comfy beds, got a really good sleep. So I'm super happy, but yeah, it's beautiful out here. So we'll, we'll be back here in a couple weeks to uh, finish it off. And um, uh, we'll be here for longer. I'll be, uh, we'll be taping, doing the T-bar drywall, you know, so it's quite, there's quite a lot of T-bar in there, but this is lots of shops and stuff here, eh? Expensive stuff, I bet. Like it's really pricey, eh? Like you gotta be, uh, there's a lot of wealth up in these areas, you know? But there's Marat right there up front taking pictures of me. <laughs> right on. So, so beautiful here, guys. But yeah, I wanted to jump on and share this with you guys. Uh, show you, um, like, yeah, we just worked through the night. and Well, not through the night, but we worked till, like I said, 8 o'clock. And, uh, yeah, the guy who who works in this cannabis shop is, 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 is cool. <laughs> he talked, uh, we talked for a while yesterday, a couple times. <laughs> But yeah, they'll be relocating the track lighting for sure. Um, I, I, if they're even using it, I, I doubt they will be even using it. This is retail stuff. It's like really, um, it's too big, I think, for what they're gonna do. They're gonna, and plus there's gonna be T-bar ceiling in here. So, oh yeah, they're not using the track lighting. They'll be taking it out. Um, and they'll be, cause um, in the, in the back, in the back here, hey, court in the back here is two by four vinyl t-bar grid and in the front is uh two by two t-bar grid so but yeah yeah it's good to get good i'm so happy we don't have to do any work today <laughs> oh man definitely made the right call but yeah complete guys complete yeah oh Yeah, push those electricians. I know, right? Uh, always pushing the electricians. The they're on the other jobs. The uh, the plumbers and the electricians are holding us up so bad. It's just frustrating because like they feel. I feel like they don't care about schedule or anything. Like they're just. I don't know. I don't get it. <laughs> but we need to get them done because they're. And the, and the worst part is they all, all these jobs we got. Uh, they're all going to be uh, the same, ready to go at the same time. You know that's the problem. We're trying to coordinate jobs, but these guys are freaking holding us up. So, um, but yeah, we need to get in there and get paid. But we're gonna hit the road. Um, but yeah, I'll make sure I'll show you guys more when we come back. Like I said, we'll be back here in a couple weeks. So, um, uh, yeah, if you guys have any questions or want to see anything while we're back, there's I might do some more street walking next time because I'll be here for. Uh, a few days next time we come back so um, I'll do I'll show you some maybe some of the back streets and stuff but yeah it's uh, it's a pretty it's a nice place here night Jasper's really nice so I'll finish it off here I'll just kind of but yeah anyways we're gonna hit the road we're gonna get back to Edmonton um, and uh, yeah we'll see you guys in the next one take care and be safe out there guys Yeah, John, I know, I, I, I get, I, I know, it's so, uh, you know, I, I just, I don't, I don't understand, like, uh, you're, you're in New York, so there's more urgency there, too. Uh, do I have my coffee everything? Oh, okay. Thanks, buddy. Um, there's more urgency in New York, I bet, than out west here, you know, like, everything's so laid back here, it's like, you know, uh, you don't get things done as quickly as you would in, in Toronto or, say, New York, you know but yeah yeah i wish that it, i wish they uh they cared as much but there's always issues like you know like with uh scheduling and um like the, you know how you, you know things happen and extras and un, unforeseen things and whatnot and they usually have a case but they like to milk it out here <laughs> i appreciate that john take care everyone bye for now